questions 22 and 23 red paper. Question 22. If the plate is positioned 30 centimeters from the lens, the distance of its real image from the lens will be. Um, so this question is just a simple substitution sort of uh, question where basically we extract the information from the stem and substitute it into the formula to get the answer that we need. So we're looking for the distance of the real image from the lens and that is represented by uh, V, the distance from the lens to the image. All right, um, so we're trying to find V. Uh, we've been given in the stem the value of uh, F, so F is equal to 20 centimeters, and the value of U in the actual question, which is 30 centimeters. So from there, we just substitute that into the formula that they've given us, which is one on F is equal to one on <clears throat> U plus one on V, um, and then we just fill it out. So one on 20 is equal to one on 30, plus one on V. Um, so usually we'd be a bit uh, scared to use the centimeters units, but in this case it's okay because um, everything in this formula is in centimeters. But um, usually what you'd wanna do is you'd wanna convert from centimeters to meters, which is the sort of standard distance unit. But in this case, not important. Um, so we got one on 20 minus one on 30 is equal to one on V. Uh, one on V is equal to <clears throat> uh, six, sorry, three on 60 minus two on 60. One on V is equal to one on 60. Therefore, V is equal to 60 centimeters. So the correct answer for question 22 is D. All right, question 23. If the plate is positioned 30 centimeters from the lens, the dimensions of the rectangular image formed on the screen will be. So again, another simple substitution sort of question. Um, we're just trying to find the value of M, magnification. Um, so basically, as from the form, as per the formula, um, M is equal to V on U, the absolute value. Basically, um, if this number inside the absolute value signs for some reason turns out to be a negative, to take away the absolute value signs and give us just the number on the other end of it, we have to make that negative into a positive. So basically um, any number that comes out of here has to be a positive in the end. <clears throat> so for example, an absolute value of negative two is equal to two. Absolute value of two is equal to two. So basically, as we can see, it just makes negatives positive. That's what absolute value means. Um, so anyway, sidetracked. Um, V, uh, v as from before is equal to 60, um, whilst u is equal to 30. Just remem remembering to keep that in the same units. Um, and therefore from there we get two. So therefore the magnification of the, um, the actual real plate uh, is two. So we go from two by three centimeters of the actual plate to four by six centimeters, thus giving us C as the answer for question 23. And that concludes questions 22 and 23 for the Acer Red Paper.